Yo. Good morning, guys. Did not have the best sleep at all because Salom was snoring all night. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. I got video evidence. I didn't hear it. The plan is we're going to pack up now, go down for a dive, and hopefully... Yeah, it's 6.30. Hopefully, catch us some breakfast, but we'll see you in the water. Let's catch us some breakfast. We're well, just on the kayak, waiting for Ethan to find a spot. Another one. Another one. All right, guys, welcome to the EJC kitchen. We're going to cook up the rasp now and the abalone. We got to first tenderize it a bit because it's pretty chewy. It's got it in the bag here. I'm going to sort of hammer it a bit with this end of my knife. <gasps> Hopefully, oh no, the bag ripped. <laughs> All right, this is not probably the best idea, but we're going to stick with it because I don't have another idea. Mission failed. We'll get them next time. <laughs> Alright, I think that will do. So we're gonna now slice it up into some nice bite-sized pieces. Okay. Working on the back of the car. Looking a bit messy. We just have our brass here. We're gonna make them bite-sized pieces and then crumb them and then cook them up. And same with our abalone. So we have our Tank Troy Everglades little mixture here. We're gonna put the fish in now. Hotel body here that we've been collecting <laughs> this year for this trip. So if it's ready. Don't, don't think it's ready yet. So I think the pan is finally hot enough. Gonna chuck in the other pieces. Look at the view. Whoa, God's country. Taking too long. Two hours later. So I think it's been cooked long enough. I'm not sure what rice is supposed to look like, but I know it's a pretty white meat so I'm take a piece that looks cool probably give it a go here we go mm. wow that's really good it's so soft to me mm. it's actually a lot nicer than i thought it'd be what do you think good marinade Good marinade. Good soft. Yeah. Good soft. What is it? Good soft flesh. Tasty. Good soft flesh. So hopefully they're all done. Well, I think they are. Got my little bun here. Next time I want to be more prepared and bring some more, some more fillings. Here we go. It's good. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, it's taking too long. The stove is just not able to keep up the heat. We waited long enough. We're going to pack up, take the abalone, go down to the electric barbecue down by the, uh, down by the park. What are you saying? And cook it. Okay, we'll see you there Please. then. <laughs> A few moments later. Cooking lunch, take two. Hopefully it cooks faster than before. Himalayan salt, chili and garlic. Or maybe not sizzling, it looks like sizzling. Crack it! Looks good so far. Taste test, here we go. This is tender. That's good. Tender. Not bad. What does it taste like? It tastes like Himalayan salt with chili and garlic. Here. Mm, it's actually really tender. Whoever tenderized it did a really good job. Abalone really is hot. It's really hot. <laughs> the bacon of the sea. Mm. Okay, guys, we're gonna eat up the abalone, take a bit of a rest, regenerate our energy, and then we're gonna go out for a dive later this afternoon. So we'll see you then. Peace! back the time to catch us in some dinner. So, I did see a number of crayfish that dive. But it turns out my GoPro was recording at the wrong angle, so most of the footage looks like this. But don't worry, you guys didn't miss much. I failed pretty badly and didn't manage to get a single one. Abalone and couldn't get a cray. Oh, I just can't get them. But hopefully tomorrow we'll get one. We're gonna go back, stuff some pasta maybe, and we'll see you later.